You may have seen a lot of videos around about how to create a Pixar-like image of yourself or an avatar of yourself. Well, I found a really cool way by Karen Ching about how to do this using a GPT, one of these kind of apps for my GPT. Hi, I'm Professor C. I talk about generative AI, and I just want to take a minute to show you how cool this is and what a great shortcut it is to create these Pixar-like avatars. So this is her GPT. I have it bookmarked over here in the left panel. But what I can do is I can say, but what I can do is click on this upload a video for a Pixar transformation, and it will then prompt and get GPT ready for that upload. Then I simply select it, and I'm going to do a bunch of them here because I want to see if I get something I really like. So here's one that was taken by a professional photographer of me a little while ago. Probably had a little bit less gray, and we'll see what it comes up with. Okay, not bad. That looks pretty good. I don't know if that looks exactly like me, but that might be a realistic interpretation. Let's try another one. All right, not too bad. Looks a little bit younger. I kind of like that. Let's try another one. Okay, and it's come back with a, yet another image. Well, this one looks a little bit more like me as far as having a little more gray, but probably a little more athletic, unfortunately. Try it out. See what you think. I think this is a great little shortcut instead of building your own prompt. I'll link to Karen's website as well as to the GPT she's created in the description below. And that way you can check out her work. She has some other great tutorials. And you can also add this to your sidebar so it's there when you need to use it. And even though this is a short video, I would have to say that if you made it to the end of one of my videos, you are part of an elite crowd and should probably subscribe.